Verticam is an additive manufacturing facility. The technologies alone are very exciting. We're here in the stereolithography room. This is kind of where it all started. All of it is based on layers. An engineer makes a 3D CAD file. Our software slices it into all those slices. So you build a layer of something, you build on top of it, you build on top of it. So at the end, it comes up out of the vat and you got whatever you got. My name is Ron Belknap and I'm the president and CEO of Protocam. Myself, another individual back in 1994 started the business because we lost their job. We really have a, a strong team of individuals. There is no such thing as Protocam. It's, it's a bunch of dedicated people that really focus on quality product for the customers in a very timely fashion. Ed Graham and I am the engineering manager here at Protocam. My role primarily is I work on projects and, and uh, quote the new projects that are coming in. Attitude is a really big part of what we look for. People with good work ethics and good attitudes is more important than anything else. If you're going to get into engineering, you need to have math skills. Good writing skills is really important as well. Part of our values and our core values of the company is to be a team. As a team, we make a lot of cool stuff. My name's Jeff Grimm and my job title is model maker and urethane technician. Our job is to finish the parts, polish them, clean them up and make them as presentable as possible to the best of our abilities. There's always another problem to solve or something else to do that you haven't done, so it keeps it kind of interesting. Doug Vokes and I'm a production specialist here at Protocam. My job at Protocam is finishing all the 3D printed models. Uh, as they come back off the machines. Really one of the coolest things about working here is communication is, is really good between everyone. Being part of this kind of a team effort, everybody has their own sort of specialty and we all come together and share information. It's all designed to just work all together. This is how things will be produced in the future. We're still discovering where it's going to lead and where it's going to go. There's a lot of products that will be designed for utilizing this technology. And we're also uh, finding new applications of existing products. And it's really neat to be involved in, in from the ground up. You're looking at the next industrial revolution.